Walking is an effective form of low-impact exercise that can help people improve or maintain their physical fitness. In this video, we look in more detail at how many steps people should take each day for general health, weight loss, physical strength, Walking is a form of low-impact, moderate-intensity exercise that has a range of health benefits and few risks. As a result, the CDC recommend that most adults aim for 10,000 steps per day. According to the Arthritis Foundation, walking can improve muscle strength, range of motion, blood flow, flexibility, balance, which can help prevent falls, joint stiffness, mood and sleep, breathing. Walking can also help improve or prevent certain health conditions, such as obesity, osteoporosis, and age-related memory loss. The benefits of walking appear to increase with step count. A 2020 study found that participants who took 8,000 steps per day had a 51% lower risk of dying by any cause compared with those who took 4,000 per day. This finding suggests that the benefits of walking increase with step count but also shows that people who cannot reach 10,000 steps in a day can still benefit from the activity. How many steps to take for weight loss? The number of steps to take for weight loss can vary depending on an individual's current weight, food intake, and target weight. However, 10,000 steps is a good goal for most people. Some evidence suggests that for weight loss, exercise intensity is also important. If a person wishes to use walking as a way to improve their strength, flexibility, or stamina, they may also benefit from more intense forms of walking. Other ways to get more cardiovascular benefits from walking and boost muscle strength include Climbing stairs Stepping up and down on a stool Walking briskly for sustained periods Focusing on objects in the distance, which can increase walking speed by up to 23%. Wearing weighted wrist or ankle straps. Nordic walking, which involves the use of poles to work out the upper and lower body. How to get more steps. Getting more steps can be a challenge, particularly for people who lack the time or face other barriers that prevent them from walking more frequently. However, there are plenty of ways to include more steps in everyday life, such as Taking the stairs instead of using elevators or escalators Going for walks during lunch breaks, while meeting with friends, or while talking on the phone Using restrooms or meeting rooms that are further away within an office building Taking breaks from working, watching TV, or reading to do something active Trying new ways to get more steps, such as dancing or hiking Parking further away than usual from stores or other destinations. Getting off public transport a stop early and walking the rest of the way. Walking to or from work, if possible.